Here at the Rose Bowl, these two teams won't have any love for each other in this gridiron bowl matchup. And we're going to have a little rain out there for today's game between the Marshall Thundering Herd and the Buckeyes of Ohio State. And here come the Buckeyes. Hi, everybody. I'm Brad Nessler with Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet. And guys, there is no better way to start off a new year than right here with some good old college football. The Buckeyes are going to have to play a great football game if they expect to win this one, Kirk. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I think you're exactly right about this. Marshall comes into this one with a good passing attack, and they have a difference maker lining up at wide receiver. In fact, Lee, I think he's one of the best receivers in all of college football. Let me tell you why I agree with you. Marshall has an advantage in this one, and that's their passing game. I look for them to get good protection, throw the football all over the place, and play like one of those all-star teams out there. Thanks, Kirk and Lee. Well, the team captains look like they're ready for the coin toss, so we'll send it down to the field. And they're ready to kick this one away. Kicks it deep. Number 34 fields it in the end zone. get the ball here at the 25. The thundering herd come out in a 34 defense. Spin move. And he's taken down at the 26-yard line. The halfback lucky to get anything on that toss play. Second and nine. Ball on their own 26. They use four linebackers. Manhut! 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 He drops back. Under heavy pressure. Complete. Number 25 with a takedown at the 28-yard line. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. Third and seven coming up here. Ball on the 28-yard line. The Thundering Herd bring in the nickel package. And he's tackled at the 38-yard line. A nice run there and another first down. Yeah, this is a delayed handoff to the tailback, and as you can see, he knows exactly how to handle it once he gets his hands on the ball. Also, Kirk, you got to give the offensive coordinator a lot of credit. A nice call there. First and 10, ball on the 38. Marshall comes out in a 4-3. He's hit and got away. Number 19 brings him down at the 49-yard line. What a run. Here they give it to the tailback in a little misdirection play, and you can see the athleticism and the ability to make guys miss. Nice play. It's first and 10, all right around midfield. Marshall lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 16, back to pass. Wafts this one out to the left. Number 30, drops the ball. Number 30, the play. It's second down and 10 to go. This is the sixth play of this drive. The Buckeyes go with the I formation. Number 30, the ball carrier. They'll bring him down at the 40. And they pick up nine there.
It's third down and a yard for the first down. Seventh play of this drive coming up. They use four linebackers. Here's a handoff, left side. Nothing doing, tackled for a loss on the play. And that was not a good call offensively. Nah, not a good call, only because they lost yardage. I'll tell you, I've seen plays like this where the tailback breaks one and goes for a touchdown. You're right, Lee, you can never tell. Fourth and four coming up on this play. Ball on the 43-yard line. Number 18, back to punt. Number 88, signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the nine-yard line. They'll take over at the nine. The thundering herd come out in the shotgun. Number seven, back to throw. Looks. And he's got all the time in the world. He lets it go deep down the middle. And it's caught. And they finally tackle him at the 48-yard line. The wideout comes up with a spectacular play. Yeah, and if I'm the coach, I put a big circle around that play so I can remember to call that one again. Good call. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. The Buckeye line up in a nickel back. And they make the stop at the 45. Just about three yards there. Second down and seven to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. Four-man front by the defense. Number seven on play action. They pick up a few yards there on the pass. And I'll tell you what, that fake handoff froze the secondary just enough to allow for the receiver to come up with a nice gain that time. Good call. It's first and ten. Ball on the 33. Marshall lines up in a shotgun set. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He's going to try and scramble. Fires deep down the right side. And it's incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. Ohio State lines up defensively in a 3-4. Number seven drops back. Under pressure. He lets it go. Complete. And they finally bring him down at the five. And the wideout gets a chance to show what he can do. Oh, he sure does. And he doesn't disappoint either. Great athletic ability. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Handoff up the middle. Takes off a tackle. Number two with a takedown at the five-yard line. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. They put everyone up on the line. Number seven steps back to pass. Let's it fly. 
He's got 2,500 yards passing. That's not a bad year, Coach. Not a bad year at all, my friend. This kid has been doing it all season long, making the right throws at the right time. And he hits the PAT. And under three minutes to go in the first quarter. The score, Marshall, seven. Ohio State, nothing. Marshall is ready to kick it away. Number 34 and number 28 set to return. Kicks it off. Number 34 fields it at the seven. They'll start this drive at the 29 yard line. The Buckeyes come out with split backs. Number 30 on a counter, left side, gets past the tackler. Number 25 brings him down at the 30. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. Second and nine, ball on the 30. They come out with four linebackers. Number 43 tackles him for a loss on the play. Kirk, they really had nothing going on that run. I'll tell you what, Brad, it's almost like he ran into a brick wall on that play. Third and nine, ball on their own 30. The Thundering Herd bring in the nickel package. Number 16 drops to throw, throws it out there. Number 12 hangs on to it. A heck of a play by the receiver. We talk all the time about the emotions of college football. This play was definitely an emotionally charged play. What a way for the wideout to make a statement in this game. It's first and 10, ball on the 34. Number 30 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They get it out there on the top. And he's tackled at the 33-yard line. A one-yard gain by the halfback. Second and nine, fifth play of this drive coming up. The Thundering Herd use a four-man front here. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Number 48 with a takedown at the 20. And that one goes for a big, big first down. You know, every time you run the ball successfully like that, the defense starts to creep up a little bit. That's when you go to the air, my friend. It's first and 10, ball on the 20-yard line. Three-man front defensively. Number two brings him down at the 10-yard line. He got a really nice gain on that run. Brad, I'm going to tell you, I think the defense needs to make some adjustments. Maybe move eight or nine guys into the box lead. Maybe they could slow down this running game. You're right, Kirk. Heck, I could run through those holes. Defense lines up, eight men in the box. Little handoff. There's a missed tackle. And down he goes at the four-yard line. The running back gives them six yards on the ground. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. Marshall, seven. Ohio State, nothing. We are ready to start quarter number two. The Buckeyes line up in an I formation. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
Number 16 gives it up the middle. Touchdown, Buckeye. Nice job by the running back, getting in for the touchdown. Let's take another look at that run. And he tacks on the extra point. Ohio State ready to kick this one off. Number 11 and number 27 back deep to return. Kicks it off. Number 27 fields it at the one. Can't wrap him up. They'll go to work at the 20 yard line. Ohio State comes out at a 4 3. Number seven, off the fake. He passes it. Tackle at the 33. A good play fake that time. Here, the play action was key. It held the linebackers there by the fake by the running back, and the running back did a very nice job of carrying out his fake. And the quarterback did a tremendous job of the fake handoff, too. First and ten, ball on the 33-yard line. Number seven is back in the gun. And he's going to lose yards on this one. That'll be a loss of one. Three. Second and 11 coming up. Ball on their own 32. Marshall comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Number seven drops back to pass. They throw a flag, and they make the stop at the 34. We've got an inverted face mask, mask on the defense. defense. Side right side right side right side right. It's third down and four to go. Ball on their own 39. They line up in the shotgun. Back to pass. Looking. He's looking for his man. And it's caught. Number one with a takedown at the 42. A pickup of about three. It's fourth down. A yard to go. Ball on the 42. Marshall ready to put this one away. Number 83 calls for the fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 25. It's first and 10, ball on the 25-yard line. The thundering herd come out in a 4-3. Number 16, back to throw. Rifles it over the middle. Gets that one. Brought down at the 46-yard line. A good play to the tight end that time. Yeah, and this is a play that we saw in practice the other day over and over again. And as a coach, you like it when all that practice pays off and your players execute in the game like they did all week in practice. Good job.
First and ten. Ball on the 46. Defense lines up in a 4-3. They get it out there on the toss. And he stopped behind the line. Good play there by the defense. This is just a toss to the tailback. But the defense gets a good read on his play and was able to stop him for a loss. Second and 11 coming up. Ball on the 45-yard line. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Tackle at the 47-yard line. About eight yards there. We've got third and three here. Ball on the 47. Ace backfield. Number 30 on the give. Number 19 brings him down at the 44. They don't pick up the first on that play. Brad, that defense is saying, not so fast, my friend. You're not going to run that ball that easy. Fourth down, less than a yard. Ball on the 44. The Buckeyes are lining up to punt it away. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Number 88 signals for a fair catch. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They'll get the ball here at the 20. They'll bring in their dime package. Number seven drops back. He's looking. Number one bats it down. And an outstanding play defensively. Yeah, he timed it perfectly and managed to get a hand in there to deflect the ball away. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 20-yard line. Number 24, alone in the backfield. He drops back. He unloads it. Number 13 makes a catch. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. First and ten, ball on their own 41. Marshall comes to the line with three wide. They get it out there on the top. Nothing doing. Tackled for a loss on the play. He didn't really have a chance on that play. Boy, guys, how about the defense on this play? They sniffed that play out from the start. It's second down now and 13 to go. Ball on the 38-yard line. Number seven with three wide receivers. Number seven drops to throw. He steps up. Number 80 has it. Number 44 tackles him for a loss on the play. They're backed up eight yards on that play. Third down and long coming up here. Ball on the 30-yard line. Number seven lines up in the shotgun. Drops back to pass. Throws a lob pass out to the right. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. And they back up three yards on that play. Fourth and a bunch coming up here. Ball on their own 27. The thundering herd. Line up to punt. Number 83 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 38.
They'll take over at the 38-yard line. The Buckeyes go with the I formation. Back to pass. He fires right. Number 88 with a catch. And they hit him in the backfield. The Buckeyes are going to take a timeout. And that was their first timeout. Second and 10. Ball on their own 38. Ohio State lines up with a split backfield. Number 16 steps back to pass. He throws it. Number 88 hangs on to it. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here. And the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. It's third down and a yard for the first down. Ball on the 47. Ohio State will line up in a jumbo set here. Here's a counter play. They'll bring him down at the 49. And the tailback gets positive yards there. This is the old counter play. Nothing too, too fancy. Just keep those chains moving. First and 10. Ball on the 49-yard line. They come out with a big set. Number 16 drops back to pass. Looks. He guns it to the right. Number four makes the catch. Number 48 with a takedown at the 39-yard line. Not a bad play there. Not at all. And if this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. The Buckeyes call for a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. It's first and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. The Buckeyes come out showing three wide. He drops back. Here comes the pressure. Complete. Number 15 brings him down at the 35. Four yards gain. As we've seen before, they go with a hurry-up offense. Number 16, back to pass. Looking, steps up, lets it go. Number 25 with a takedown at the 31-yard line. And Kirk, that was a nice grab there. You know, it may be simple, but whenever you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. Back to pass. He lobs it out to the left side, and it's caught. And he's taken down at the 26. Holding. On the offense. Third down and 12 to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. Marshall brings in the nickel here. Drops back to pass. He lets it go. Complete. Number 48 brings him down at the 31-yard line. I'd like to say one thing. The reason they were able to get something out of this play is the fact that the quarterback had time to get rid of the football. Good job up front by the offensive line. And don't forget the nice play by the running back as well. Fourth and two coming up on this one. Ball on the 31. The thundering herd put four men up front. Hunt. Hunt, hunt, hunt. Number 16, back to throw. He scrambled. He fires left side. Number 15, tips it away. That'll do it for the first half here. We're tied as the players head to the locker room. Ohio State got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. Kicks it off. Number 27 fields it at the nine. They'll start this drive at the 24. 
Marshall comes out in the shotgun. Number seven drops the throw. And it's caught. Number 37 with a takedown at the 29. Nice little pattern there. Yeah, he had great position there. And that ball was thrown in the right spot. Second and five coming up here. Ball in the 29. Number seven with three wide receivers. He drops back, steps up in the pocket, gives a little pump fake, lets it fly, tipped away. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. Third and five. Ball on their own 29. Number seven lines up in the shotgun. One hot. One hot. One hot. One hot. Back to pass. Throws it out there, and he can't hang on to it. So the defense gets him to go three and out. Good job here defensively forcing this incomplete pass. It's fourth down now, five yards to go. Ball on the 29. And the punt team will come out. It's fourth down. Number 16 punts it, and he didn't kick that ball well at all. Number 83 signals for a fair catch. Go to work at the 40-yard line. The thundering herd line up in a 3-4. Number 16 pitches out to the right. Number 48 brings him down at the 48-yard line. Nice pickup on that run. Here's a perfect example of running the toss play. Good pitch, good catch, and blocking was good enough up front to spring this tailback to a monster game. First and 10, ball on the 48-yard line. Ohio State sets up in the eye. Cut. 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 Gets the ball. No, they faked it. And they couldn't hook up on that one. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 48. Marshall lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 16 drops back, rifles it right side. Number two knocks it away. Nice job knocking that one down. You're right. Good job there on the coverage. That's just what they teach you to do. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 48-yard line. The thundering herd bring in their dime package. 16 steps back to pass he passes it off his hands incomplete that looked like a pretty good pass yeah it was and it was a catchable ball going right at him he just didn't catch it right. it's fourth down and 10 yards to go ball on the 48 yard line the Buckeyes line up the punt Number 88 calls for the fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 14. They'll get the ball here at the 14-yard line. Number seven comes to the line with three wide. Drops back to pass. He's under pressure. He's looking for his man, and it's knocked away. And they do a good job at swatting that one away. You're right, Brad. Excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and his get his hand on it. Second and 10, ball on their own 14. 
The thundering herd come out showing three wide. They'll run the option. And they got him for a loss. This is a great example of how to defend the run. Here the fullback has nowhere, and I mean nowhere to run. Yeah, nice job by these guys. They can be very sound defensively. It's third down and 11 to go. Ball on the 13. Ohio State lines up in a dime defense here. He drops back. There's a fumble. It's scooped up. Number 39 with a takedown at the six. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Ah, uh, rub some dirt on it, kid. Get back in the game where you belong. Number 30 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Number 16, back to pass. Loses the football, tackle at the nine. And so the defense comes up with a fumble. Is that turnover gonna hurt them? Well, every turnover hurts, but hopefully for their sake, this running back will go out there next time and hold on to the football a little bit better. First and 10, ball on the nine. The thundering herd come out in the ace formation. Number four, drops back to pass. Fires a bullet over the middle, and he can't make the catch. Second and ten, ball on the nine. Number seven, lines up in the shotgun. And he puts it on the turf. Number six brings him down at the 12. They almost gave them a present right there. Yep, the running back gift wrapped it and everything. Lucky someone on his own team fell on it. They're down in seven, ball on their own 12. Number seven is back in the gun. Back to pass. He unloads it. And it falls incomplete. How about that? He's got to come up with that catch here. Yeah, you're right, Coach. This is a catch that has to be made. There's really no excuse for dropping that ball. Fourth and seven. Ball on the 12-yard line. They send out the punting unit. Number 16, hunts it, and he didn't get much distance on it. Number 83, signals for a fair catch. Excellent field position to start the drive. Number 16 with three wide receivers. Number 16 back to throw. He throws it. Number 30 has it. Number 21 with a takedown at the 42. Couldn't get anything out of that. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 42. Defense lines up in a 3-4. 16 gives it up the middle number 19 brings him down at the 40 that'll be a two-yard game third and eight ball on the 40-yard line the thundering herd line up with six defensive back complete Fourth down, Coach. Yeah, they just didn't get enough yards on that pass. Fourth and one. Ball on the 33-yard line. The Buckeyes line up in a split-back set. Put hot! Put hot! Put hot! 
Number 30 takes a handoff. Loose football. Number 44 recovers a loose ball. And a big change in momentum right there, Kirk. Well, the defense is playing inspired football right now. The ball popped out, and everybody was on the ground grabbing for it. First and 10, ball on their own 31. Six DBs in the lineup. Here's an option, right side. Number 13 with a takedown at the 31. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. So it's second and 10, ball on their own 31. Ohio State brings in the nickel here. And he's going to lose yards on this one. Well, that play sure didn't work. Brad, this is a sensational play by the defense. They just charged in there, and they stuffed it. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 31-yard line. One man backfield. Number seven drops back. Fires a bullet out to the right. Number two brings him down at the 50-yard line. Oh, my, that long game gives him a first down, Coach. A first down and a nice pass play. Knowing you can convert on third and long will open up your offense a little bit more on first and second. Let's see what they do from here. It's first and 10, ball on the 50. Defense lines up in a 4-3. They hand it off. Ball's loose. And it looks like the safety got on that one. The offense has to hang on to that ball better. I agree, but you have to give some credit here to the safety. He made a nice play falling on the fumble. First and 10, ball on the 41-yard line. Number 30 lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Hunt, hunt. Number 16 steps back to pass, lets it go, bat it away. Great defensive play by the cornerback. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 41. Marshall comes out in a 4-3. They get it out there on the toss. And he's tackled at the 48-yard line. Seven yards there. It's third down and three to go. Ball on their own 48. Number 30, alone in the backfield. Number 16, options out, laterals back. And down he goes at the 47-yard line. And they get the first down on the option to the halfback. It's first and 10, fifth play of this drive coming up. Marshall lines up defensively in a 4-3. Little shake and bake move. Number 44 with a takedown at the 47. No gain. So it's second and 10. Sixth play of this drive coming up. They line up with split backs. Number 16 drops to throw. He's looking. He goes downtown. And it's caught. Number two brings him down at the 23-yard line. The wide receiver picks up good yardage that time. It's first and 10, ball on the 23. Ohio State lines up in a pro set. Put hot, put hot, put hot. 
Number 16, back to pass. Looks, he lets it go. Number 12, with a catch. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. Second and less than a yard. Ball on the 13-yard line. Ohio State comes out with two tight ends. Number 30 gets it on the counter. And he's taken down at the four. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front. The tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. And we're ready to start quarter number four. Ace backfield. Number 30 on the handoff. Touchdown, Buckeye. The halfback followed his block was right into the end zone. This back has great vision, which allows him to make runs like this one we just saw. And here's the replay of the touchdown. Ohio State to kick this one off. Number 11 and number 27 deep to return. And they'll be returning this one. Number 11 takes it from the six. They'll take over at the 28-yard line. The defense lines up with six DBs. Stop behind the line. He's going to come out. It looks like he was hurt on that last play. Hey, that kid went down hard, but he's a tough kid. He'll shrug it off. It's second down now and 13 to go. Ball on their own 25. The Buckeye come out in a 34 defense. at the 27. A two-yard run by the halfback. Third and 11. Ball on their own 27. The thundering herd come out in the shotgun. Number seven drops back to pass. Looking. Let's it fly. Complete. They'll bring him down at the 37-yard line. They didn't have a ball on there. Having ball control is important in football. And three it out is what you want to avoid for sure. Fourth and one. Ball on the 37-yard line. It's fourth down, and the punt team lines up. Number 83 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 27-yard line. They'll start this drive at the 27. They come out with four linebackers. Number 16, back to throw. He's looking. Heaves a long one down the middle. Number four hangs on to it. 
And the wideout gets a chance to show what he can do. Oh, he sure does. And he doesn't disappoint either. Great athletic ability. It's first and ten. Ball on the 29-yard line. The Buckeyes come out in a two tight end set. Number 16 drops back. Throws it out there. And it's incomplete. Kirkie just let that one get away from him. Yeah, and you can see he wants that one back. That's a throw this guy can make in his sleep. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 29. The Buckeyes line up with three wide. Breaks one, and he's taken down at the 23. The running back gives them six yards on the ground. It's third down and four to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. Ohio State comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Number 16 hands off on the delay. Tackle at the 14. And that was a nice gain, and he's going to have enough for the first down. Well, I think, Brad, the offensive line won the battle up front. You could see the defensive line getting knocked backwards, allowing the ball carrier to pick up a nice gain. First and 10. Fifth play of this drive coming up. The Buckeyes come out in the ace formation. Brought down at the 13-yard line. And he gets a yard on the run. Second and nine. Ball on the 13. They come out with four linebackers. Play action, fires across the middle, and it's knocked down. Good awareness defensively that time by the linebacker. Not only that, but as you saw, he also made a very athletic move to get to the ball. Now it's third and nine coming up. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Four wide. He drops back. He's in trouble. He passes it, and it falls incomplete. What happened on that one, Kirk? Well, I think he's trying a little bit too hard to make that perfect throw. Just step back, fire the football. Don't think so much about it. Fourth and nine coming up here. Ball on the 13. Number 85, lined up for the field goal. This should be a chip shot. The kick is up, and it's good. State is ready to kick it away. Number 27 and number 11 back ready to return. Kicks it off. Number 11 fields it at the nine. Yuku. They'll go to work at the 29 yard line. Ohio State lines up defensively in a 3-4. Number seven steps back to pass. Looks. Incomplete pass. Boy, would he like to have that one back. Yeah, you're right. This offense relies so much on timing. And as you saw there, when their timing gets knocked off, they have a tough time connecting on plays like this. 
So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 29. Four man front by the defense. Back to pass. He's looking for his man. And he's tackled at the 31. And they were stopped for a minimal gain on the play. That was a sensational effort by the defense. They were all over that pass. Third and eight. Ball on the 31-yard line. The Buckeye bring in their dive package. Number seven, back to pass. Looking, he unloads it. And it's incomplete. Fourth down, eight yards to go. Ball on their own 31. Marshall lines up for the shotgun set. He throws it. And it's knocked down. That was a calculated risk there, don't you think? Yeah, I think it was. Sometimes you have too much confidence in your offense, and it cost them there as they turned it over on down. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. The Buckeye go with the eye formation. Nice spin move. And down he goes at the 29. That's 100 yards rushing for the day, guys. You know, Brad, 100 yards is a great day. But the thing that I've been most impressed with is the way he's been able to accomplish that with such great effort. Right. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 29. The They'll use a 4-4 defense right. here. He jukes. And they push him out at the 20-yard line. And the tailback picks up great yardage on the run. How many times did we see him run that play in practice this week? A thousand times. And it was just as successful then as it is right now. First and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Marshall comes out in a 4-3. Drops back to pass. Let's it go, and it's caught. Touchdown, Buckeye! They had some trouble defending that one, though. So. Hey, this is just a great play by the offense, Brad. Watch that delivery. It doesn't get much better than that. And he tacks on the extra point. So under three minutes to go in the fourth quarter. And the score is Ohio State 24, Marshall 7. Ohio State to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number 11 fields it at the two. Right. It's first and 10, ball on the 25. Marshall comes out in the shotgun. He drops back. He steps up. He's looking. He lets it go. Number 90 makes the catch. Number 6 with a takedown at the 36. A good play to the tight end that time. Yeah, and this is a play that we saw in practice the other day over and over again. And as a coach, you like it when all that practice pays off and your players execute in a game like they did all week in practice. Good job. Number 7 drops back to pass. Looks. Guns it across the middle. It falls incomplete. That one's just too hot to handle. Yeah, the quarterback might want to think about taking a little bit off his passes in those situations.
Second and ten. Ball on the 36. Trips right. Number seven. Back to throw. Complete. A nice pass play there. Let me tell you, the reason why this play worked was the fact that the defense didn't do a good job of knocking the wide receiver off his route. You got to jam him at the line and throw the timing off. Number seven drops to throw. Under heavy pressure. Rifles it over the middle. And that one's fallen incomplete. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 48. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Number seven drops back. He fires right. And it's caught. Brought down at the 48. Four yards gained. Back to pass. Under pressure. Looking. Tipped away. Coach, you made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. Fourth down and six. Ball on the 48. Marshall comes to the line with three wide. Drops back to pass. Fires a bullet over the middle. It's dropped. Not much of a chance on that one. Well, they had to go for it. They're at a point where there's not much time left, and you got to put it all on the line. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. The thundering herd. Line up in a 3-4. at the 47-yard line. About five yards there on the fullback carry. Second and five coming up here. Ball right around midfield. The Buckeyes line up in a goal line formation. Gives it up the middle. They'll bring him down at the 42-yard line. About five yards there on the fullback carry. Third down, less than a yard. Ball on the 42-yard line. They line up in the jumbo set. 16 gives it up the middle. This tackle, number 15, brings him down at the 39 yard line. And that's a first down on the short gainer. First down, and this will help their efforts in chewing up some more of the game clock. It's first and 10, ball on the 39. Marshall comes out in a 3 4. Number 30 gets it on the inside. A little juke brought down at the 30-yard line. They'll get nine yards on the play. And that's the end of the ball game. Girk, what'd you think of this one? Well, it's not the outcome most people were expecting. Marshall didn't think these guys will give them any trouble at all, but it ended up being more competition than they could handle. I think they overlooked this one, and it came back to haunt them. Thanks for joining us for another presentation of NCAA Football 2003. And once again, our final score in this one, Ohio State 24, Marshall 7. We hope you enjoyed this game as much as we enjoyed bringing it to you. So long, everyone.